Sunday. I want to share a little story with you. You might wonder why, but you'll figure it out. So, today for lunch, I had a salad with cucumbers on top. And this is an important thing because for years, I would not touch cucumbers. I thought they were disgusting. I mean, honestly, there's not much flavor to them. But there was this time when I was in college when I ate a cucumber that was past its best, like to the point where it was a really bad decision, but I was sort of doing that. I'm in college, let's save money. It's not totally inedible, it's just weird and soft. Um, wow, it feels funny just admitting that I ate this to you, but I say this because that experience was disgusting and I really didn't have much of it. And I lost my taste for cucumbers. They're nice, nutritious vegetables, but I couldn't touch them for years. And then gradually I realized, actually, I should give them a try again. A nice, fresh, lovely, crisp, crunchy, juicy one. And they are now back in my diet. I'm enjoying them nicely, and I'm sure they're enjoying me eating them, I guess. And this goes for you. The point of the story is that can be translated in many ways. It was something that you tried that you didn't like, it was too squishy, past its best, whatever. <laughs> but say an activity, say a person, say lots of things you can relate this to that you did not like when you first tried it, you had a bad experience. So why don't you try it again? It might be delicious. It might be amazing. You might have a different perspective because the you today is different than the you back then who tried this thing, who tried friending this person, who tried whatever it is. Times have changed, things move on, and so now it's time for you to think about what is your cucumber? What is your thing that you have just cut out of your life because it was gross that one day and realize that actually it could be healthy, crispy, delightful, and wonderful for you today? Could be an activity that's so, so much fun, maybe bicycling, you had a bad crush, but actually you love it, really, and so it's time you get back on that bike. Or, I don't know, your neighborhood baker. Maybe he had a grumpy day, but actually he's an awesome guy, and it's time you get to know him. Those are my comparison ideas for you. Think about what that is to you, and report back to me on what things of the past can now be new and fresh and wonderful. Talk to you later. Bye.